Hello everybody. Welcome back to another session of Mathematics Made Easy. Today we have a question from circles. If the non-parallel sides of a trapezium are equal, show that it is a cyclic. Non-parallel sides of a trapezium are equal, show that it is a cyclic. Now, take a trapezium ABCD. In this trapezium ABCD, non-parallel sides in the trapezium ABCD, AB and DC are called as parallel sides of a trapezium. AD and BC are called as non-parallel sides of a trapezium. As per problem, these non-parallel sides are equal. So AD equal to BC. We are required to prove that ABCD is a cyclic quadrilateral. Instead of proving ABCD is a cyclic quadrilateral, we need to prove that Opposite angles are supplementary. So we are required to prove angle B plus angle D equal to 180 degrees. For proving that ABCD is a cyclic quadrilateral, we are required to prove angle B plus angle D is equal to 180 degrees. Now, we know that a trapezium is a combination of one parallelogram and one triangle. Consider a point E on AB such that AE and CD are equal. Because this AE, CD is a parallelogram, we know that in a parallelogram opposite sides are equal. So AE is equal to CD. And similarly AD and EC, they are also opposite sides of a parallelogram. And we know that opposite sides of a parallelogram are equal. So that AD measure and EC measure both are equal. Already it is given AD measure and BC measure both are equal. Here we can take that in the parallelogram. In the parallelogram ABCD. AD is equal to CE. Opposite sides are equal in the parallelogram. And next one is AD equal to BC. AD is equal to BC given already in the question. Assume it as equation 1. This is equation 2. From equations 1 and 2, AD and CE are equal. AD and BC are equal. Finally, we can say that AD is equal to CE is equal to BC. AD measure CE measure and BC measure, all these three are equal. Consider the triangle BCE. In triangle BCE, these two sides EC and BC are equal. So we can write BC is equal to EC. We know that in a triangle if two sides are equal, angles opposite to them are also equal. EC opposite angle is angle B. And BC opposite angle is angle E. Both are equal. Now we can write angle B is equal to angle E. Let angle B is equal to angle E equal to X. Assume this angle is X and this angle is also equal to X. And come to this uh, parallelogram AECD. In parallelogram a, E, C, D. Opposite angles are equal. So assume this angle is a Y. This angle at vertex D is also equal to Y. Because opposite angles are equal. Now we can write angle D is equal to angle E is equal to Y. See in this uh, diagram A, B is a straight line. X, Y are angles on the same straight line. We know that angles on the same straight line, their sum is 180 degrees. So add these two, x plus y is equal to 180 degrees because they are angles on the same straight line. But in place of x, we can take that angle b, write x as angle b plus in place of y, we can take angle d is equal to 180 degrees. Angle B plus angle D equal to 180 degrees. In this quadrilateral ABCD, X plus Y equal to 180. 
opposite angles are supplementary we know that if opposite angles of a quadrilateral are supplementary then it is a cyclic then we can say a b c d is a cyclic quadrilateral thank you so much